Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Let me start this video with a sorry for not uploading any kinds of videos of walkouts or drills. It was due to the fact that I had an injury three days back. It was an ankle injury and, and I couldn't move from the bed. I was literally lying on the bed for past three days. So, so that's the reason why I couldn't upload any kinds of videos. So let me say sorry for that. But I took this as a chance for me to show you something new. As you know, every football player needs to have a prior knowledge about his position and overall game. So I put forward to you a chance to see and learn your position and the overall game using my game analysis video series. This game analysis video series will help you to analyze and learn different positions in the game and also be aware about the changes in mentality of a player as the game situation changes. I'll try my maximum to upload a video once in every two weeks because as you know these type of videos requires a lot of effort behind the scenes. I hope you all will enjoy it. Keep watching. As an introductory video of the series, I would be analyzing one of the most underrated but crucial position in the game. You might have guessed which position I am talking about. Yes, it's central defensive midfielders. As I play in this position, I have much more knowledge about this position. So I just want to share it to you. As you know, the modern game has changed a lot when we compare with the era of Pele, Cruyff and so on. So the increase in the use of press in the modern game has made most of the teams to push back their creative hub to the front of the defensive line so that they can build from the back. So I would like to call them as a deep line playmaker as they are most efficient in playmaking and in the defensive tactics as well. When every one of us focuses on star players like Cristiano Ronaldo, Messi, Neymar, Hazard, it's these defensive midfielders who work tirelessly and continuously throughout the game to help the defense out and also the offense when needed. There are many defensive midfielders in the world, you know. All of them are awesome CDMs, but today we will see Sergio Butzkatz's play. I'm gonna analyze his play using some random clips. This is a clip from the match between Barza and ba Valencia from Copa del Rey. So here he received the ball as a center back, which 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 allow the full back to move further up the pitch and support the offense when they have the ball in position. This is a perfect example of a, de a defensive midfielder playing to help the defenseman in position and oppositions pressing higher up the pitch. So in this clip, when PK intercepts the ball, Busquets set back himself to receive the ball and, and soon he heads back to the defender to keep them in position. And so you can see this is how a CDM reads the game and understands the situation wisely. So here I'm going to pause here. When the center back are tightly marked, he comes down to receive the ball from the keeper so that he can play and move the ball up front. So in this clip, Busquets constantly checks his surroundings before receiving the ball. He saw the defender coming from behind and passes the ball in one touch. And he recognizes the pressing. So he moves to make a passing line between Messi. And then soon he receives the ball and moves up front. In this clip, he receives the ball at the center of center from the humidity. At the same time, he checks his shoulders on both sides. And he saw the defender approaching him, so he thereby makes a fake pass that he gonna pass to Iniesta, and he takes the balance of the defender. It's a brilliant play play from Busquets there. So here you can see how he intercepts the ball. Whenever there's a pressure to his teammates, he he comes up and takes the ball wisely, and this is how he brilliantly reads the game and look look how cool he is at the center of the pitch so this is a main attribute 
of a CDM. From all of these clips, you can clearly see that he often play as a defense, but at the same time makes crucial passes up front. So you can see a pass there to Iniesta to the wings. Now he receives the ball as a center back and he clearly checks the passing lane to his teammate and he brilliantly passes it to the wide. Now he passes it to Iniesta but but he suddenly recognizes the pressure to Iniesta and he sets back himself to receive the ball back. And then soon he passes in one touch to Umititi to wide so that they can build up wide. Interception and reading the game is one of the crucial parts of CDM's play. Now th this is another clip of he intercepting the ball and passing it to wide in even in the pressure situations. This this clip shows how he wisely passes the ball to make any kind of attacking sequences. So here is another interception from Busquets and see see how he finds the pocket of space between, between two defenders so that his teammates have a great passing line between him. Now this is a clip from the game between Barcelona and Tetafe in La Liga. So you can see in even in this clip he finds that small pocket of space between two defenders which which makes the passing easier for his teammates. So see Busquets how he packs himself to receive the intercepted ball. So now you can see he is he recognizes the interception and he packs himself to receive the ball to the back now here is an interception from sergio busquets see how he wisely tracks modric and he takes the ball and passes to the goalkeeper So this is a clip showing his cool and calm nature even at high pressure situations. He is a very brilliant and cool guy for this position. So here Neymar gets a ball. So as soon as he gets a ball, you can see Busquets backing up himself because he, he knows there will be an interception. So when Barcelona loses the ball, it's it's him that comes to support the midfielders. So that's how a CDM should work. Now from this clip we can see that Busquets showing the possible options for the defender to pass so that they have they can keep the ball in position so a good cdm will allow himself and his teammates to play calm and cool so this is a brilliant clip which which shows the reading mentality of biscuits so he he just runs through the pocket of space there at the wings and 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 can give a brilliant pass to the forwards which in turns turns to be dangerous so see see the movement of Busquets as the center back moved forward he he just went back and fills his position
as the savvy as savvy inter intercepts the ball he he just he just created create many one of the many options for savvy to pass and give him confidence that's a cleared ball from getafe so just see busquets finding that large area or space so when he receives the ball he has a lot of area to play so that's how he he makes himself and to play and gives a brilliant ball to neymar so the same situation arises again there's a cleared ball from getafe and and see how wisely busquets gets in front and receives the ball so he have a lot of space to play through here busquets again receive back the ball this this clip shows how brilliantly he turns to the back to create a lot of space at the right wing so that the team can play move further up the pitch so when busquets recognizes the mark marking by the opposition he receives the ball from xavi and plays it back to the wing and look how cool coolly he delivers the ball across the wings now busquets play play will play a great pass so that's the analysis of central defensive midfielder busquets so whenever you watch the game don't just see through the game just learn through the game by watching you, watching players of your position and keenly analyzing what they do in game changing situations thank you that's end of the video hope you guys enjoyed it be sure to like and subscribe and comment below if there is any suggestions bye bye